welcome back to my channel if you are new here hi my name is Cassandra um, so today's video I decided to do this video because I recently went back to work I know that it could be very difficult to go back to work so I felt like making this video to tell you my experience of going back to work with two kids under the age of three my experience and how it went in general excuse my lighting i am filming this at three o'clock so it's not very nice out the sun is like sort of setting so like if i move over i get the sun in my face kind of thing so no, that's why God. my lighting is not the greatest no, um God, please, but no, yeah so no, from my experience no. i went back to work tuesday and we are now Friday. Today I had off, um, which was a little bit fun. Um, so I get to go get the kids early and bring them late to daycare. So it's really been only three, three days that I worked. And honestly, the first day was the toughest. I worked from 8.30 in the morning until 4.30 p.m. What? So I really thought it was hard in the beginning especially bringing Esme. Esme has been going to daycare for the past two weeks before this week. Um, so she's been kind of used to being at daycare and she's taking it really well. She she loves it. She's kind of used to going there. When I used to go bring Jaden and she stayed with me, she would come with me every morning and she would, she would see the daycare um, lady I don't know how you call that in English, but the caregiver maybe. She She's seen her like pretty much ever since she was born, obviously. She, she really took it well. She's starting to eat solids, so she's eating like little pieces of stuff by herself and which is which is incredible. I can't believe she is now 10 months going on 11 months at the end of this month which is going by way too fast but yeah for her it's been going really really well she's been eating well sleeping well uh she doesn't cry when i leave in general she's been doing very very well um for me the first day going back i found it really tough especially leaving the kids and knowing that I can't go get them when I feel like it knowing that I have to wait until a certain hour to go get them which my daycare closed at 5 so I feel rushed you know to go get them because I finish at 4 30 I, I really really found it tough but as it's going it's getting a little bit better for my schedule on next week I finish at 3 o'clock so at least that's really a plus and it makes me so happy because I know that I don't have to rush to go get the kids to make supper to you know just everything in general so I found it really really hard in the beginning there obviously it obviously was hard I guess on me physically but also mentally leaving Esme and um, I felt I, I really felt like crying I was very upset to have to leave her but, you know that's life I guess <laughs> I wish that you could stay with your kid at home until they were at least five and when they go to school that would have been cool you know for the government to pay us to stay home because here in Quebec we are paid our maternity leave and we are paid for a year Esme is 10 months I unfortunately because your your maternity leave is one year but you, the time that you stop like so when you're pregnant and you stop I stopped at 24 weeks but my maternity leave started at 36 weeks so you lose those those weeks until you give birth and then well now see she's 10 months because um, I took those weeks off for being pregnant but yeah so in general I would say that going back to work is not always easy um, even for Jaden oh my god in some ways he's felt I think that I've been stressed out and it's been affecting him. He's been like really grumpy, not listening. The the kids been waking up at like 5, 50, 6 o'clock in the morning every morning and normally they would sleep in till like 7. 
it's it's a whole entire a new adaptation. Um, I find it I find it difficult, of Help course, me. but uh, hopefully it gets me. better. But yeah, I just wanted to come here and make you guys a video. I also forgot to mention that I find it very hard recently, um, especially night times and waking up in the morning. Um, a lot of the times the kids are not wanting to go to bed and then the next day I have to wake up at 6 in the morning to get them ready for the next day. So it's very difficult in terms of waking up and getting them ready and also my boyfriend has been working evening shifts so he's been working from 3 to 11 so I do not have help when I get home from work. I have to do everything by myself which sucks and hopefully this little evening shift is only temporary. Well it is a replacement but he shall be going back working his night shifts soon hopefully. And yeah, that's all I wanted to add. And tell you guys how I feel about going back to work and how the kids have been going. And I wanted to make sure to have a video up for you guys. Although I am back at work and I am looking like a mess, you know, my hair is not done. And my makeup's not done. I just really wanted to come here and make a video for you guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have any suggestions of any types of videos or like sit down videos, talk videos that you guys would like to see, leave a comment down below. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.